Okay, welcome back. Um, as I was reviewing the last video, I did find the lost goody hut, and here it is. Um, I was watching the video, I'm like, oh my god, there it is! Stop! Stop the movie! And then I just kept kind of going like this, looking around. So, I don't know, we could figure something out for that later. That'll be there for a while, I think. The AI is not the best at picking those up on the island expansions. And this is a good plan anyway, of kind of seeing what's going on in this area. So when I wanted to take a quick look at who has what wonder, um, we see Stonehenge here, the Great Wall on Bismarck, and the Great Library on uh, Napoleon. Um, not sure who got... Well, I guess those are all the wonders that have been taken, right? I mean, we have the Great Lighthouse um, is available, the... Uh, Colossus, I believe, is still up for grabs. Yeah, Hanging Gardens is still out there, the Pyramids. So not a lot of wonder going, uh, wonder building going on so far. So we'll, we'll maybe we can see about picking up a, a late snipe of one of those guys. So let's uh, proceed here. Um, no, sorry. Cotton to Ramses, so um, we might think about actually hanging on to that for now. We'll see in a second. Uh, what was I doing over here? Oop! Oh, there you go. More ancient ruins. So, um, again, I mean, look at this. Three fish and four atolls if you go here. Well, three atolls, but still. It's pretty damn nice. I mean, you're not going to run into that on any other map script, um, so it's pretty cool. Um, we can use the the sea here to grow, so we might as well just start our get our production started here. And then we're going around and racing these roads here. Okay, heal. Um, since I'm bringing the spearman to the front, I do think I possibly want to think about putting an archer there. But then again, Egypt seems pretty friendly, so it's probably not really an issue either way. So we're going to kind of swing him into position for our, our assault on Paris. Still be a few turns yet. We we want to get a catapult out, catapult out, and I seem to recall having one more spearman somewhere. But um, oh no, I I guess he's over here exploring. So we might want to think about getting um, maybe a, something like a swordsman out or something. But as soon as we finish the oracle, that's probably what we're gonna go ahead and do. <clears throat> so no, we're not gonna make friends with someone that everybody else hates. And we're not going to sign a with the highest score Civ in the game. Yeah, look at her. Look at her go. Surprisingly, we're doing pretty well. I mean, there's only one point difference for the most part here, but it's nice to know that you're not like back of the pack tech-wise. It's comforting. So yeah. Here's where we might get a few cheap shots off on Napoleon, so we'll just kind of hang out here for a minute. Alright, um... Kind of be interested to know what is right here. Okay. Okay, let's begin our exploration. Let's get to that hill. And here's our other spearman, so we're going to want to bring him to the front, for sure. What do we got here? Seven? Yeah. Alright.
Oh, we got a chop on that library. That's nice. Kind of thought that was a jungle, actually. Bismarck's in the medieval. Where are we? I'm pretty sure we're in classical, right? Just out of curiosity, yeah. About to hit up medieval. So we're doing fine, tech-wise. Can't really expect to be beating all the AIs by turn 101. It's just not a possibility. Um, can we get... Yeah, so we have that open borders with Germany, so we can get to that hill. Yeah, okay, so they're... Let's just take a look at that. <clears throat> we kind of thought that this land was sort of available to Montezuma, but clearly Bismarck's right here, so they're going at it a bit. Have we met everyone? six, I think. I can't remember if there's... Yeah, I'm pretty sure we still have yet to meet one Civ. What? What? Okay, so the graphic for the road is still there, but the road is in fact gone. Let's just double check your tile. Yeah, that's what we want. What the hell? Alright. We can deal with that pretty easily, I think. Pick up some XP. So things are looking pretty decent for the Oracle right now. I mean, the Hang Gardens did just go, but I'm pretty sure that the Hang Gardens has a higher priority even than the Oracle still, so I feel pretty good about getting that wonder. Um, we're going to have to take this worker. We don't really have a need for it particularly, but we do want to finish this tree. Um, I'm just sort of contemplating saving this policy choice until we finish engineering, but I feel pretty committed to finishing Liberty at this point, so let's do that. You can maybe use the worker as like a, a scout for France, although he only has one city, so we'll see. Um, now, do we go this way, or I think we'll just head into Germany at this point, see what they got going on. Now, can we get around this ice? So good so far, or so far so good, whatever the saying is. Russia? Yeah. So, god damn it. Does anyone know, is it possible to turn off the unit cycling? I've been unable to find a uh, option for that. It'd be nice to know if I can do that or not. So here's our free worker. Um, it's hard to say at this point whether or not we're going to want farms or trading posts. Um, we haven't quite decided on our sort of end game economy at this point. Um, usually when you have a lot of food it can kind of go either way. Um, I mean, like I said we are thinking about commerce. I want to show you this tree. It's really nice. Um, so here we have plus one gold on villages and plus two on fishing boats. And then we come down here and we have a minus 20% purchase cost for units and buildings. So, I mean, we're kind of leaning towards a gold economy at this point, but I think for now, we'll just farm up and, you know, if we need to make the change, we do apparently have some extra workers at this point. So that will be quite easy to handle when that does come up. Um, I mean, so their next tile is either three food, one gold, or two food, one production. I mean, we don't really need to improve the city but we don't have anything else to do, so I, don't know, I think we'll just kind of build some farms or something, I don't know. And maybe we can just send him to this city and doesn't quite need it, but yeah. Funnily enough, my game timer was at 420 when I happened to glance down at it. Um, yeah. Yeah, 19 turn policy, that's a long time. Oh, I kind of forgot about Amadi over here. 
How much do we really need them? What are they giving us? Pearls? Kind of do need the happiness from them. And they're giving us that iron. So we're going to have to suck it up, I think, here. We need the gold, but... Um, they're giving us units and happiness and strategic resources, so... Let's keep that up for the moment. Now... Huh. Did we do an open borders thing with her yet? Здравствуй. No. And as much as I don't want to give her mutual, I don't want to pay 50 gold for her open borders, so... Прекрас. So be it. <sighs> Finding a lot of city-states. Nice. Keeping our gold up. I know, I said I was going to bring him here, which I will do. Um, okay. Can you get anywhere? I guess you can go. Oh, Rana. Let's get on that road. <clears throat> Berlin. Catherine just entered medieval, um, which is strange. I thought she was sort of the tech leader, but maybe she just sort of has a better spread of techs than Germany. And let's just double check on our science. Eh, we're just getting two from that research agreement. So, I don't know, hard to say. Hard to say. Okay, all that gold per turn from Napoleon is going to end in 11. I think it was 5. Yeah, the um, peace treaties are 20 turns in the Vanilla Enhanced mod. Um, rather than 10, I think they are in Vanilla. <clears throat> so while you can take the full deal and you know go for the 30 with whatever, whatever resource they're giving you, you cannot actually declare war um, for until 20 turns after the initial deal is made. Makes it a little bit more interesting when decided whether or not to accept uh, an AI capitulation. Um, I'd like to get down here, but I'm kind of getting blocked of it. I don't know. Well, let's do it. Let's be, see everything we can. Now, okay, that kind of dead ends. So, let's keep going. It's a big continent. I think it looks a little bigger than ours. Hard to say. And what is this? Yeah, there goes the peace treaty. So, what tile did you decide to work? You want to go three food and grow an eight. It's the same production and same growth. Now, if we don't work anything, we lose a turn off of our growth. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to do this. Maybe work on the scientist a little bit. Um, I don't know if it's going to come in time for to help us with machinery, but it will help us with something. So here comes the library and a growth in York. So that's another two science. And that's the video, guys. So I will catch you in the next one. All right, peace.